watch. A breaking news update now. An 11 year old boy trapped in the sand on the Lake Michigan shoreline. It happened at Kohler Andre State Park in Sheboygan County. Michelle Fiore is live at Children's Hospital tonight with an update on that child. Good evening, Michelle. Good evening, Tom. Well, he was playing in the sand when it fell like an avalanche, trapping him for about an hour and completely covering him. That boy is now here at Children's Hospital, where he is expected, miraculously, to live. What started as the perfect day at the sand dunes ended in panic along the Lake Michigan shoreline. When the 11-year-old boy became trapped, his 10-year-old friend ran for help. Were you scared for your friend? Uh, very. Joe Rose took us to the spot where he and his friend had been digging tunnels in these sand dunes. The first two tunnels were great, but then... We tried to build, take another, a third tunnel that led into that tunnel, and it, he went in there to do it, and it just collapsed on him. A mound of sand covered the 11-year-old from head to toe. When the sand fell, what did you think what was happening? Um, I just thought, well, it looked kind of like he wasn't stuck very w well in there, so that we could probably just pull him out. But we tried, and he was just getting, like, he couldn't. He just kicked around, and we couldn't get him out. Rose ran through the dunes to get help. I was telling them that, um, Avery is stuck in the sand, and he just... We were building a tunnel and it collapsed on him. Witnesses wanted to help, but with the sand falling in like an hourglass, they waited for police. It was a little nerve wracking to, to know a kid you know, was trapped, which is pretty scary. You got to give him credit for trying to have a little fun, but it was a bad spot to do it. And it wasn't easy to rescue that boy. As first responders would dig away at the sand, it would fall back in, just like that hourglass expressed. Now, I spoke to the boy's father. He tonight says he wants to express his heartfelt thank you to those crews. Reporting live outside Children's Hospital, Michelle Fiore, today's TMJ4. Michelle.